Ria should seriously look into giving us tips on what not to do to get sued by celebrities. You know why? Because now Jay-Z, oh no, we are about to get into that. But before we do, I have a business shout out. Now, if you are looking for convenient shopping right at your fingertips, Glamorous Closet is for you. They've got amazing clothes for you ladies, amazing shoes for you ladies, and it doesn't end there. Upon the amazingness, we are entering a festive season, Kalo Kusana. So if you spend 500 rand or more, you get a 10% discount. Yes, Tana. And if you buy two pairs of shoes, you get a 10% discount and a bag on top. I'm for real. Oh, get on the website right now. And to shop, you just need to have an account or you can register one so that checkout is easy for you. You can also order via WhatsApp. So the clothes are readily available. But if they are not available, you've got them on back order, which may just take seven to 10 days longer. But guess what? Your clothes will still come to you. Now let's get into delivery. You can get your clothes delivered to you via Epexi, which is 50 Rand, or Eremex, which is right at your doorstep for 70 Rand. But if you are outside a house, you pay 80 bucks, 80 Rand. Come on, guys, come on. And they do have AMA refunds and exchanges in seven days. I mean, Look at the clothes, look at the shoes. What, what are you waiting for? Start ordering yours. I'm here for it. I'm here for all of it. My husband's poor bank account. Start shopping, guys. I will leave all their website details in the description box down below. Their WhatsApp details in the description box down below. They also have a physical store at Bechley in Kempton Park. Or if you are in the Midland area, they do collections there too. So come on, didn't I not say convenience? Yes, I did. Check them out. Yan amugela and wenyami bumt abaga dead bumt abaga koko bumt abaga anti bumt abaga sisi. I am Sims and it's at the right Sims on Instagram. So please follow your sister. Yebo, guys, now Uriya Hopani. Hmm. The presenter on Everything SA podcast has been slapped with another letter from a different lawyer, from a different celebrity, because obviously that's his bread and butter. Talking about people making things up and not saying allegedly. So remember, Uriah, we just spoke about him yesterday, saying that he said, literally, verbatim, that he is shocked that the entertainment industry kept quiet when they know that um Mr. Jezik sacrificed Ukila Kau and Umpura to get ahead in his career. Of course, Jezik did not take this lightly because I mean, I mean the sorcery of it all, the flying broom limpopo electricity of it all. He was like, uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. I'ma send my, my lawyers upon you. Okay, I'ma unleash my legal team upon you. Okay, you thought Bonang did damage to you? You thought Udorothi did damage to you? I'ma show you how. So, uh, Uche Zik's legal team, yes, and the guys, you know what I like about Uriya? He, 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 he's always ready to give his fake apologies. He's always ready to give these fake apologies, knowing very well he doesn't mean anything. But guess what, Kenna? So, a letter was sent to him from Jezik's lawyers, ne? Khurin. Bafuna i i bafuna u u u Uriya. I would throw it what he said and offer an apology, but Uriya still hasn't done that. So uh, they are taking this matter further, like obviously I suspect. But this this child has no money. This child has no money, but he keeps on uh, going around throwing allegations. I am not sure. Oguti. When he started his podcast 101, did they not have lessons now? Because at least that they give you tips. If you're not sure about anything, just throw allegedly. If you know you stay 600 kilometers away from lawyers and your bank account is 3 million kilometers away from lawyers and you don't want to involve them in anything, just a hint of allegedly there, a spice of allegations there, and maybe here and there, I guess. 
I think. Well, I hear they say. It is rumored. You know, things like that. But no, this boy stays on the wrong side of these celebrities and they want him. They want him bad. I don't know. Uti, maybe Une plan me understand. Maybe and he knows how to pay a man or suit. Maybe got he 50 rand a month. He's got a pep cell account. He's got a mobile cell account. He's got a time bank account. He's got a discovery bank account. Also join it up fella till he dies because he has to pay up. I wish like I really like want I really want to see one day which I've been nelanga like in court, unfortunately, because this is wrong guys let's be honest this is wrong as much as we are doing the same work because he is my colleague Ria is my colleague and I mean yes we are uni entertainment news and they call us gossip on some other days you know but we also need to tell these stories with like with with, with gasp or like could make these stories and sometimes our sources we are not sure about them we are we, yes we can verify some few things but a little bit of allegedly uh, here and say rumored here and there really goes a long way i have learned that okay through uria you know now I'm in the beginning i never used to say allegedly and i'm not saying go search for those videos but stop okay Anyway, guys, let us talk more in the comment section down below. I really want for Jezik to see this lawsuit through because he's dis oh, yeah, disrespect. Huh? This is disrespect at its peak, you know? And he's going to I issue another fake apology. Well, cue the fake apology. Ah, uh, guys, I'm so young. I don't know what I'm doing. Eh, me, me, blah, 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 blah. Shut up. You know exactly what you are doing. You know exactly what you are doing. You want the views. You want the ads. You want to peak. You want to trend so here's the letter from the lawyer read it thoroughly nicely and slowly thoroughly and slowly then call us as your colleagues and tell us what it feels like to be sued because i legit don't want that feeling and funukwanto and no no me me I'm trying to furnish my new place. I ain't got the time, the date or the address to be fetched by celebrities, which is why I will try my best to stay on the other side of the I will always stay in front but not too in front on the passenger but next to the mirror. You understand it isn't jalo. Yeah, guys, let us talk more in the comment sections. I will see you on the next one. Bye, Ria. Blagil. Is she there? Eh.